hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is julieta and if you're new here please don't forget to subscribe like and comment on this video so today i want to share with you guys my cheap perfume collection not necessarily cheap it's just perfume that are below hundred dollar when i started building my perfume collection i know that i was not going to be able to afford all those two hundred dollar three hundred dollar five hundred dollar perfume so i was looking for something that is on the budget below hundred dollar that smells amazing lasts long nice packaging and also affordable the first perfume in my collection today is this chance chanel chance chanel perfume that i absolutely love it smells amazing it's floral perfume but not too oh my god absolutely yes we love this it smells good it's not too floral like it's not those perfume that you smell and you're smelling like air freshener no this smells so matured but feminine in the same way and the packaging is also just gorgeous 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 so i got this in 50 ml and this costs around probably 60 dollar or 50 something dollar i'm gonna pull the main accord in this perfume so you can get an idea of how it smells and how it feels main accord in this perfume is musky patchouli powdery white floral woody soft spice earthy vanilla warm spice and iris you can smell the vanilla in it it's not too much can also my, the second perfume in this collection is this Chanel perfume. This is a L'Oreal Chanel. This is not actually a perfume. This is a toilet, head toilet, head toilet. <laughs> oh my God. This is me attempting to speak French. So this perfume is more like, um, it's very floral. The, the floral is more pronounced, like it's very, very sweet. It's a sweet perfume and it's also very calming. I spray this perfume mostly when I'm at home, when I just want to lounge at, around the house and smell good. And my husband will pass by and be like, wow, babe, you smell nice. What is that? What are you wearing? This is the perfume that I put on. It just makes you smell so sexy, so calming. So I'm going to put the men accord in this perfume. Let's see what's inside that is giving us that sex to it so this perfume has citrus floral white floral fruity definitely it's very fruity i think it has like all orange blossom and peach in it that makes you know that gives you that fresh smell vanilla fresh wood sweet powdery aromatics these are the main accord in this perfume and I absolutely love it. When this finishes, I'm probably going to go ahead and buy the Earth perfume. You know, not the toilet. Toilet? Toilet? <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and buy the main perfume, the main scent, because I absolutely love this. And I pair this together when I want to go out. I don't use this alone when I'm, when I'm going out because I don't think it lasts long. I've not tried it, but I believe that, you know, the earth toilet doesn't last as long as the main perfume. So when I'm wearing this outside, I pray with this and this just gives me that feminine energy. It just gives me that cute girl, kept woman kind of energy. That, that's the vibe I get from these two perfumes and I absolutely love it. Packaging is amazing. Simplicity is the way to go. Like you don't need to do too much. Just simplicity. It sits really, really beautiful on my shelf, and I absolutely love these two perfumes paired together. So moving on to the next perfume. The next perfume is from Hugo Boss. Did I tell you guys how much the last perfume cost? No, no. Okay. This cost sixty-eight dollar on this. It was not on sales. I bought this at. Ethiopian airport at the duty free in Ethiopia. Most of my perfume I buy at the airport because it's cheaper and there's always on sales. And you can also get the 50 ml, you can even get the 30 ml if you want. Because Next perfume we have in this collection is this Hugo Boss perfume. Just look at that gorgeousness. Look at that gorgeousness. Just look at it. It's just beautiful. It's just giving Lady Boss vibe. Like, look at that with a touch of femininity to it. You know, I absolutely love this one. Actually, one of my favorite perfume. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh my god! See, perfume is life. 
perfume is absolute life i love this i love the packaging the color the bottle how it just transition from rose gold to whatever color is given now it's just beautiful this smells amazing this is strong it's floral but it's strong it's not a sweet perfume but it's floral perfume with a strong sense of identity like you put this on if someone knows this perfume they will recognize that this is the perfume you're putting on it has its own unique scent so i absolutely love this i spray this when i want to when i have like important meeting or i have like interview and i just want to make good impression i put this on there's another perfume in this collection that i pair this with together but you know you guys will get to see that as the video goes on but i absolutely love this okay let's put the main accord in this perfume and see what's inside that's giving it that you know rich woman vibe that it has okay in this perfume we have is woody wood white floral earthy you can always smell like you know it just brings you down warm spice patchouli aromatic citrus very small you don't even taste this the citrus like you don't smell the citrus in it that much sweet not really soft spice you can actually smell you can get the spiciness from this perfume and i absolutely love this this is actually on the more expensive side of my collection this cost around 75 dollar and this is 50 ml oh my god it's 50 ml and it costs that much um okay <laughs> yeah this is 50 ml and this is 75 dollar for this bottle i bought this when i was in israel and it was not on sales it was not on duty free i just i went to the supermarket and i saw it and i you know picked it up no supermarket to fragrance store saw it liked it picked it up moving on to the next perfume which is our fourth perfume that i absolutely this next perfume i was sleeping on it i was totally totally sleeping on it this is the Ta -da! <laughs> oh my god yes this is the black opium i think this is black opium shock the main accord in this perfume is white floral like i told you guys it's a floral perfume but it has its own identity like it smells really good like really good it has fruity coffee yes you can definitely get the the coffee scent coming from it sweet citrus one, one spice aquatic floral i don't know the second word the next word and animalic these are just weird names are they really mm. anyway whatever that is it makes this smells really really nice it makes it smell amazing i love this do i pair this with any other perfume i'm not really sure but if i'm gonna pair this i'll probably pair it with this um with this one you know because this is very sweet this is sweet but not as sweet as this so this together would actually be incredible i'll try it i don't know i'll try it okay the next perfume in this collection ah this one is one of my newest perfume in the uh, this one is one of my newest perfume that i bought recently and i bought it as a gift to give to someone but i decided to keep one for myself i bought it as a gift to give to two people but when i opened one of them i'm like ah. I said, you know what? I will keep this one. I will keep this one. I found something else in my bag and gave to the person. This is the Labelle Lancome perfume. Oh my God. Yeah. Absolutely, yes. We love and we live. We love and we live. This one, eh? Like, it's not that unique. Like, it's it's... It doesn't have a strong identity but it's this type of perfume that you spray every single day like it doesn't have it doesn't give you too much stress you don't need to feel a certain way to spray it i wake up in the morning i feel like i don't know what to wear let's pick this up and spray and i also love the packaging i love the simplicity of the packaging and this little thing going on here yes i love 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 Mm. and the main accord in this perfume is sweet definitely there's sweetness a lot of sweetness to it vanilla you can smell the vanilla on it fruity yes patchouli woody powdery white floral earthy iris and warm spice yeah you have it 
this is this is gorgeous it's cheap it smells nice everyday perfume it's just it's nice it's a nice perfume it's a nice perfume there's nothing else i can say about it our second to the last perfume here is one of my oldest perfume in this collection it's like the perfume that i've used much more than any of this perfume this is the pure xx by paco rabani this is one of my you know it's the perfume that got me into building my perfume collection so it has a special place in my heart I started wearing this back in 2019, beginning of 2019, my then boyfriend, which is my husband now, gifted me this as, was it a holiday gift, I don't even know, and I really loved it, and I've been using it since. I don't think there's anything special about this, to be honest, but it's the perfume that I like. It's one of my signature scents, my everyday signature scent. I pair this perfume with almost all the perfume here whenever I go out. It's my everyday, everyday perfume. Though now I don't wear it as, as often as I used to wear it because, I, like I said, I have more perfume than I used to have you know, a couple of years back. But yeah, I absolutely love this. So let's put the main accord and see you know, the ingredient in this. So the main accord are vanilla, definitely, sweet, woody. The woody is more in it, like it has more, it's strong. Even though it has vanilla and sweetness to it, it's a strong perfume. It's not that floral like, compared to like the Chanel one and the Black Opium one. Um, it has powdery coconut. You can also get the sense of coconut in it. It has yellow floral, lactonic, mox, definitely the mox is there. Fruity and white floral. I don't smell any fruit from this. Maybe like orange blossom or peach. Hmm. Anyway, that is the main accord in this perfume. So that brings me to the conclusion of this video. Yes, um, I hope you enjoyed it up until now. And I just want to say this, you do not need all this perfume in your collection. I don't think that anybody needs more than five perfume. You don't need more than five perfume because I'm seeing all over TikTok and Instagram, people are showing the perfume collection of 100 perfume, 400 perfume. Like, make it make sense how are you wearing 400 perfume 100 perfume 50 perfume i i i and for someone who owns i i just recently found out that i own more than 10 bottles of perfume and i have four of them that i've not even opened yet there's the one that i bought recently that my husband bought for me uh, for christmas that i've not even opened and i only bought that perfume because everybody was doing everybody was raving about it, about it on the internet i bought it it smells really good but i've not used it because i have so many other perfume to use i don't think anybody needs more than five perfume two everyday perfume one perfume that you smell you spray when you are around the house and you want to lounge around the house or you want to get into the business you know that perfume that makes you feel sexy but it's just for the home and then two other perfume that for special occasions for date nights wedding parties and stuff like that you don't need more than that in my opinion you don't need more than five perfume so find your scent don't buy what someone recommended on this on social media always go there try them on if you like it you buy and always buy like 50 ml or 30 ml except you really really like it that's when you can go for the 100 ml but i also believe that why have 100 ml when you can use the money for the 100 ml to buy two separate perfume and just have more variety you know but yeah that is just my own cup of tea if you enjoyed this video don't forget to like subscribe comment down below anyway guys thank you so much for watching and i will catch you guys in my next video bye for now bye